Berenon is growing up so fast. I have heard him say his first words, and he has already begun to walk. He enjoys it. He's laughing with every step. It hurts to look into his eyes, for they are his mother's. Sometimes it feels like she is still here, in him, and looking at me. But it's just my imagination. She is gone, taken by an evil that will have no place in this world anymore. I will see to it. How did it go? We won't be seeing any more lords. Excellent. Antanas is safe. Our job is done. I want to speak to him now. Not yet. There's more work to do. We will meet you in the planetarium downstairs. Why can't we speak now? Antanas will reveal his plan to you in the planetarium. He can only explain it to you there. We'll meet you downstairs when it's safe. Don't waste time, Harkin. Get to the planetarium immediately. We will meet you there.
Well done, Harkin. Antanas is here, and he wants to speak to you. Harkin, Kazlo tells me you've been victorious against the Rogar Lords. It is a feat my own men have not managed. They don't die easily. Tell me how you do it. It seems I'm their natural predator, and I don't like to lose, ever. This war has been waged for far too long and far too great a cost. My people are suffering. I cannot protect them as long as I'm trapped in this godforsaken place. Why are the Rogar attacking in the first place? A deer intends to destroy me. I represent everything he fears. What could a god fear? I pull demons from the hearts of men, Harkin. I undo Adir's work right before his eyes. This awoke his fury, and now he's returned. Antanas has learned how to separate evil spirits from men. He can free them from their dark side. This angers Adir. You can see how cruel he really is. If Adir is victorious, we will all live under his rule. I am the people's guardian. I am the only thing standing between them and Adir. And I will fight this battle until I no longer draw breath. The tide has turned in our favor. Battles have been won, but the war yet wages, Harkin. We should move you to a safer location. No, Harkin. Antanas is the one the Rogar seek. They will hunt him down no matter where he goes. But we have a plan. One that will bring the battle directly to our true enemy. You mean the Rogar? No, Harkin. I mean the god. It's not every day I get to kill a god. Indeed. How am I supposed to do that? You must return to the Rogar realm. Once there, kill the remaining Rogar lords. Once they are gone, Adir will have no choice but to enter the fight himself. And when he does, you finish him. Why has Adir held back? He's a god. His lords have been his proxies in this war. Once you've destroyed them, Adir will have no choice but to step onto the battlefield. In that moment, Run your blade through his foul heart and end his existence. I understand. Not all of the lords are in the temple, Harkin. Some of them might be staying closer to the god. You will need this to access the heart of the Rogar realm, the Chamber of Lies. Your gauntlet will be able to open the path inside the Chamber of Lies, if you allow me to prepare it. Luck in battle, Harkin. If we meet again, to celebrate your victory. Harkin, before you go... Yes? There's something strange going on here. I don't know what exactly, but I intend to find out. 